Well, as I say, uh, we are in the church of San Bernardo in London and uh, we uh, are really happy to let uh, introduce this beautiful day to uh, Father Umberto uh, because he will talk us uh, to this very important uh, Thank you very much. I'm very happy for Nashville the Palm Sunday. It's a Christmas moment for Sunday, for Easter. The Vishnu Maharaj's and Jesus him in the Fagan and Gospels. Please, uh, uh, Padre Umberto, if you uh, would you like to read a little bit slower. In many Christian churches, Palm Sunday include the procession of us on the Shaharim Palms. Presenting the palm branch to grow the scatter at in front of Jesus as the road in the Jerusalem. The difficulty of procuring palms in unfavorable agreements led to their supposition. With the branch on native trees, including box, yew, willow, and olive. The Sunday was often designated by the names of three trees. Three trees, no black. As in a U Sunday, or by the general term branch of Sunday, phenomenon, a final day, you were also it. Well, uh, Padre, please, uh, biblical basis and symbolism in the accounts of the four canonical Gospels. Jesus' triumphal entry into Jerusalem takes place about a week before his resurrection. The symbolism is captured in Zacharina 9.29, the coming of Zion's king. See, your king comes to you. Ay, a fort na cosa sordicette. Righteous and victorious, slowly riding on a donkey. On a colt the fall of a donkey. Uh, professor, uh, please, Padre Umberto, don't uh, uh, make a personal com. Uh, not a personal com. It was perceived that Jesus was declaring was the king of Israel to the anger of the Sanhedrin. To what, Professor? Sanhedrin. According to the Gospels, Jesus rode the dung into Jerusalem and someone asked him, Ma, ma why did you bring the, the horses? Say Jesus, Jirai uh, Areta, who is this guy? He said, uh, he said, uh, Paul, he said, he said, he said, he said, non, uh, non, uh, don't look at him, uh, vai avanti e pass. The people sang part of Psalms 118-25-26. Bless this who comes in the name of the Lord and Nature, we bless you from the house of the Lord. Uh, Padre, please. The symbolism of the donkey, it's not because you are ignorant, but be referred to the Eastern tradition that is an animal of peace, which oh, when Naples play football, we must know that he has to win because he's the football of peace. Uh, professor, please not, uh, in this case, we are in a religion um, arguments, Versus the horse, which is the animal of war. I said, uh, uh, a king came riding up on an horse when he was bent on war, rather right up a dung when he wanted to point out he was coming in peace. Hello. We have two chances in our life. Or Takato Shuch, or Takato Gaval. Which kind of life you want to have? Hello. Si tu stango po Shuch. To, you are uh, on uh, on the peace. Si tu sengo po cavallo fa guerra contra Ushuch, eh, eh, this is the donkey, this is not about Jesus, please, Professor, Jesus entry to Jerusalem with this symbol inside, symbolize, scusate uh, uh, for my accent, this entry as the Prince of Peace, not as a world walking king. In Luke 1941, as Jesus approached Jerusalem, he looks at the city and weeps over, an event known as Flavit Super William in Lady, foretelling 
the suffering that awaits the sea, the Angor, Ekeke. In many lands, in the ancient Near East, it was customary to cover in some way the path of someone through worthy of the eyes owner. The Hebrew Bible reported that Jew, son of Joseph Avat, was treated this way, but the Synopic Gospel and the Gospel of John report that the people gave Jesus this form of honor. However, in the Synoptics, they are only reported as laying their garments and cut rushes on the street. We, whereas John specify from the palm, Greek phoenix. In Jewish tradition, please be careful and pay attention, pay attention, and pay for all everything. The palm is one of the four species, carried for Sukkot as prescriptive for rejoining at Leviticus 23.4. In fact, uh, Jesus went to um, uh, quella che vendeva l'ice cream, cioè lo tieni cioccolato e succotto. Cioè no, a un momento la ricetta di Jesus, ma I go just for the peace. He said, uh, the ice man said, fai bu, vai andando. The palm branch was a symbol of triumph and victory in the Greco-Roman culture of the Roman Empire. And become a ceremonial to suit the most common attribute of the goddess Nico Vittori, Nike. It never reached carpet. He had also the shoes of Nike, and he was supposed to play in the Nike of Vittori. He was winning the championship. For contemporary Roman observers, the procession would have evoked the Roman triumph. When the triumphador laid down his arms and wore the toga, he said, What are you wearing? He said, A toga. He said, me to scorn. He said, no, because uh, why the civilian garment of peace that might be ornamented with emblems of the palm? Of all the epistles of Paul referred to Jesus as triumphing the entry into Jerusalem, may not have been regularly pictured as a triumphal procession in this sense before the 13th century. Right? Periodo della grande Sant'Agostino e San Tomaso. In ancient Egyptian religion, the palm was carried in funeral procession and represented the eternal life. The palm branch later became a symbol of a Christian martyr and their spiritual victory or triumph over death. In Revelation 7.9, we, the white-clad multitude, stand before the throne and lamb holding palm branches. In the 16th and 17th Palm Sunday, was marked by the burning of charcoal and the figures. She didn't let you know, I am a jack. I figure it, she put a portal album with a lavani. The professor, please stay on the spot. This was a strategy which would be stoned at Bush. It's a burning on Palm Sunday was often supposed to be a kind of revenge of Judas Iscariot, who had betrayed the Christ. It could have also represented the hated figure of winter, whose destruction prepared the way for spring. Well, thank you, uh, Father Umberto. Uh, we take a short break. Let's have a Napolitan coffee, and then we go on with the observance in the liturgy with Father Agostino.